About time you've come to. On your feet, inmate. Our master wishes to speak with you. It's for your own sake that you take his words to heart. First off, let us celebrate our reunion. Oh, you've awakened to your powers, and special ones at that. Your rehabilitation can finally begin. There is no need to understand it all for the time being. You will be training the power of Persona, which you have awakened to. Personas are, in other words, a mask, an armor of the heart when confronting worldly matters. I have high expectations for you. You have no choice but to hone your strength. It's not because we're forcing you, but because this is your fate. Neglect it and you will die. By the by, have you come to appreciate the Metaverse Navigator? Using it will allow you to come and go between reality and palaces. I bestowed it to you as a means to train you as a thief. The Metaverse Navigator is a gift from our master. You better take care in using it, inmate. Devote yourself to your training so that you may become a fine thief. It must be disheartening to make use of the Metaverse Navigator alone. Should there be others who would prove beneficial to you, I will grant it to them as well. This is all for you to grow as a most excellent thief. <laughs> it's time. Go back and enjoy whatever rest you might have. Seriously? Uh, what's going on? Look, isn't that her? You mean that one with the red ribbon? I guess so. She's so thin. It's not fair. I've got my hair in a ponytail, too. Okay, and what's that got to do with being thin? Please, take my seat. My station's coming up. Are you sure? Oh. speed. I mean, excuse me, that seat was for this lady. Oh. It's all right. I can understand his position as well. I'm sorry I couldn't be any help. It's all right, dearie. Don't you worry. Please allow me to carry your luggage, at least. Thank you. Ain't it heavy, though? Not at all. I train plenty. Pardon me. Thank you so much for earlier. For speaking up when I offered my seat on the train. You're a second year at Shujin Academy, correct? I'm a first year there myself. Thinking you totally slipped my mind back on the train, and I didn't want to be rude to my senpai. Please excuse me.
Class is starting. Hey there, Takamaki. Things have been pretty dangerous lately with all those accidents. Sorry, I have a photo shoot today. It's for the special summer issue, so I can't afford to miss it. Hey now, being a model's fine and dandy, but don't work your pretty little self to the bone. You mentioned you weren't feeling well, right? Something about appendicitis? Yes, I keep planning to go to the hospital, but I've been too busy. Sorry to worry you. You must be lonely, too. I feel bad for keeping your best friend at practice so often. Oh, and be careful around that transfer student. He's got a criminal record, after all. If something were to happen to you... Thank you. Please excuse me. Yo. I want to talk about that castle from yesterday. I tried telling myself it was all just a dream, but I couldn't do it. I can't act like nothing happened. It's all connected to that bastard Kamoshida, after all. I want to find out what's up with that place, no matter what. And you know, you're the only person I can rely on for this stuff, so... You in? Nice! <laughs> okay, glad we're in this together. I think we should just try and retrace our steps from yesterday. In the meantime, you're walking to the station, right? Let's go together. Let me know if you notice any other weird buildings on the way. If a huge castle like that really exists, I'm sure we'll find it in no time. When did they build something like that, though? We walked that way from here, right? When you put it that way, I'm not so sure anymore. All right, this way. Let me know if you notice something. School. There wasn't anything out of place along the way, right? I didn't see no castle either. Ah, we must have made a wrong turn somewhere. Let's try again. Don't worry, I won't mess up this time. Let's go. If 
for real? Is it smaller than we think it is? What do you think? I already did that. I didn't see anything like it around here. Huh? Phone. Hey, that reminds me. Didn't you have a navigation app thingy on back then? I don't know if it was or not, but I heard stuff that sounded like one coming from your phone. You know, didn't it say stuff like returned to the real world or something like that? Let me see your phone for a bit. What's this eyeball looking thing? What? What a weird app. Oh, wait, this is it! I knew it! It is a navigation app! There's even your search history! Oh man, I'm such a genius! Let's try using it. Why? All we're doing is starting an app. Tamoshida. Shujin Academy. Pervert. Castle. Beginning navigation. Here we go! And then we went in a certain direction and... Hey, what are you... Huh? What the hell? Yesterday. We made it back. That means what happened yesterday was for real, too. Yeah, those clothes. That happened last time, too, huh? What's with that outfit? Like it? What's going on here? This makes no effing sense at all. Hey! Stop making a commotion. Uh, you? The shadows started acting up, so I came here wondering what it could be. <sighs> to think you guys would come back to the entrance when you barely managed to escape. What is this place? Is it the school? That's right. But it's a castle! This castle is the school. But only to this castle's ruler. The castle's ruler? I think you called him Kamoshida? It's how his distorted heart views the school. Kamoshida? Distorted? Explain it in a way that makes sense! I shouldn't have expected a moron to get it. What did you say? What was that? It must be the slaves captive here. For real? Oh shit, it's for real. We saw other guys held captive here yesterday. I'm pretty sure they're from our school. Most likely on Kamoshida's orders. It's nothing out of the ordinary. It's like that every day here. What's more, you two escaped yesterday. He must have lost his temper quite a bit. That son of a bitch! Ryuji? This is bullshit! You hear me, Kamushita? Doing that isn't going to open it, you know. Still, it seems you have your reasons. Hey, Mona Mona! It's Morgana! Do you know where those voices are coming from? You want me to take you to them? Well, I guess I could guide you there. But only if he comes with us. It's settled then. 
for real? Thanks, man. All right, let's do this. Follow me. This is our infiltration point. Ain't that where we escaped out of last time? That's right. Not barging in through the entrance is one of the basics of phantom thievery. How are we supposed to know about that stuff? I'll make sure to teach you as we go. Come on, follow me. So, uh, sorry for dragging you into all of this. But I just can't forgive that bastard Kamoshida doing whatever the hell he wants. Really, though, thanks for coming along. I owe you big time. Man, this place is as creepy as always. Mm hmm Now make sure you do exactly as I say, all right? Follow me. there would be guards here. It looks like we're going to have to start fighting our way forward. Uh, for real? Oh boy. I'll just teach you the basics of battle for now. You better not forget to always try to ambush enemies instead of rushing everywhere headlong. Attack from behind whenever you can. You'll need to rip their masks off to momentarily break the control that the palace ruler has over them. If you succeed, your opponent will be caught off guard. Allowing us to jump in for a preemptive attack. So, we want to get the jump on him and make the first strike. Okay, got it. Uh, you know you're just going to be watching, right? You don't have a persona. But anyway, let's go. your true Where form. here damn it they were here before where'd they go quiet down oh yeah there were more of them further in too they might have been transferred already oh crap I can hear footsteps coming lots of them it would be a problem if they discovered us now hey let's head into that room we should be able to hide in there until they leave. The shadows probably won't come in here. How can you tell? There's a lack of distortion here, meaning the ruler's control over this area is weak. Is this a classroom? Now do you understand? This place is another reality that the ruler's heart projects. This is Kamoshida's reality? 
Ugh, shit makes no sense at all. One could say it's a world in which one's distorted desires have materialized. I call such a place a palace. A palace? This is happening because he thinks the school is his own castle. So it became like this because he just thought of it like that? <laughs> Son of a bitch! You must really hate this Kamashita guy. Hate doesn't even cover how I feel. Everything is that asshole's fault. I don't know what happened between you two, but don't let your emotions get the better of you. His lackeys are everywhere inside. You're curious about your outfit, aren't you? Yeah, I'm curious as hell about it, too. That's also because of this world. More stuff that makes no sense. Anything distorts according to how a ruler pleases within his palace. A school can turn into a castle like this, after all. In order to prevent such distortions, one must hold a powerful will of rebellion. Your appearance is a manifestation of that. It's the image of rebellion that you hold within. Uh, I'm so fed up with all this! I'm more curious about you than his clothes! What the hell are you anyways? I'm a human. An honest-to-God human. No, you're obviously more like a cat. This is... well... it's because I lost my true form. I think. You think? But I do know how to regain my true form. The reason why I snuck in here was for a preliminary investigation of those means. Well, I ended up getting caught, though. Besides, I've been tortured by Kamoshita, too. I'm gonna make him pay for sure. What is this, a comic book? This is seriously crazy. If we're gonna keep going, we should hurry along. I'll be counting on your skills this time, too, rookie. Got it? Don't worry, I'm not gonna force it all on you. I thought it might help, so... I brought this just in case. It's a model gun, though, so it only makes sounds. That's a toy! But it looks totally real, so it'll at least fake him out. Oh, I brought some medicine, too. You know what they say, providing is pre-something. Huh? Huh? So you were planning this from the start. Well, fine. If you're ready to go, we'll resume our infiltration. There are probably still sentries making their rounds out there. Let's use this time to hash out our current situation. to the training hall should be just beyond the... So, uh, what are we gonna do? Do we gotta... Seems like it. Just don't let it notice you beforehand. If it does, the palace is... Uh... Well, the security level will go back down if we can beat more enemies without getting noticed. That sounds, uh... Fine. I'll put together some info. This is crucial to successful palace infiltration. So make sure...
Okay. Hey. like an intruder no nobody yet shoot I had a feeling there would be a lot of enemies it'd be impossible to dodge all of them then what do we do should we try and take him down like before it's not that simple we still have a long way to go so we should be conserving energy I uh, damn it I wish I could fight I'd at least be able to help out a little bit but all I got is this toy from earlier huh do you mean that gun? Yeah, that looks real and all, but it doesn't shoot anything. I see. Well, there is a way. Okay, we'll use that to take down the enemies. What? Were you listening to me? It don't even shoot pellets. Don't worry, I'm sure this will work. Attack away, frizzy hair. Dude, I, I keep saying... gun with you, right? Point it at a shadow and fire. where rapid fire is going to be more useful than swinging your... Of course, you can run out of ammo, but using it all up does more good than letting it collect... All right, I'll show you my weapon, too.
guard. I'm pretty sure that's where we need to be going, too. You guys gonna take it down again? I guess that's our only choice. But wait. This mu- Okay, I've decided. I'm gonna teach you two a special way to fight enemies. Something like that. Let's go! Listen, there's a distinct flow to battles. Let me show you. After all, first, knock down all the enemies. Everything starts at that crucial step. Well, you're dead. What was that super move thing you just did? I told you, it's called an all out attack. If you manage to knock all the enemies down, you might be able to use it to beat them all at once. Yeah, that was over quick. It's a concentrated attack on defenseless enemies, after all. Now, as I mentioned before, I want you to be the head of our command. You can decide when we use this. Strike the enemy's weakness, knock them all down, then do an all-out attack. That's... your voice down but this is beyond messed up how do I open this stop it leave us alone it's useless huh if we stay obedient we won't be executed like you guys you're telling me you want to stay in a place like this? Wait a minute. Were you planning on taking these guys out of here? We can't just leave them here. How stupid can you be? What? These are only humans in Kamoshida's cognition. They aren't real humans that have entered from reality. They're different from you two. Cognition? It means there's no point in saving them. They're different from the real ones in the real world. You could say that these are extremely similar looking dolls. What the hell? Why is it gotta be so complicated? So the school's a castle and the students are slaves. It's so on point that it makes me laugh. This really is the inside of that asshole's head. Still, this is horrible. It must mean he treats them as slaves in the real world, too. In the real world, too? Wait, I know these guys. They're members of the volleyball team, the one Kamoshida coaches for. They must be physically abused every day. There's no way they'd be so beat up normally. Don't tell me. They're going through similar shit in reality? Most likely. I mean, this proves that Kamoshida thinks of them as slaves. So, it might be for real. I heard that Kamoshida's using physical punishment. They're just rumors, but... If they're true, wouldn't this be something to report to the police? I'll use these guys as evidence. 
If it all goes well, we can take down that asshole Kamoshida. Huh? It's not working. We can use the navigation app, but the camera's a no-go? A navigation app? That's what we used to come here. What about yours? Whatever you do is fine, but we're gonna get caught if we stand around like this. We need to head back. Hang on a sec. There's no other way. I'll just memorize their faces before going home. Let's go! Again? To think you'd make the same mistake again. You're hopeless. The school ain't your castle. I've memorized their faces real good. You're going down. It seems it's true when they say barking dogs seldom bite. How far the star runner of the track team has fallen. What the hell are you getting at? I speak of the track trader, who acted in violence, ending his teammates' dreams. Oh, I can only imagine the pain of the others who were dragged under with your... Si <laughs> what a surprise. So you're accompanying him without knowing anything at all. He betrayed his teammates and crushed their hopes. Yet he still carries on as carefree as ever. That's not true! What a tragedy! You blindly trusted this fool, and he's led you right to your death. Hurry up and dispose of them. I can't stand their stench. God damn it. Ryuji, move! We're surrounded! I'll kill you! I'll kill you because King Kamoshida told us! I'll tear! I don't see a weakness. more of that <laughs> failure can't be oh. oh 
you. I bet you simply came here on a whim and ended up like this. Isn't that right? No. What a worthless piece of trash, getting emotional so quickly. How dare you raise your hand at me? Though it was only temporary, have you forgotten my kindness in supervising track practice? It wasn't no practice, it was physical abuse. You just didn't like our team. It was nothing but an eyesore. The only one who needs to achieve results is me. That coach who got fired was hopeless too. Had he not opposed me with a sound argument, I would have settled it with only breaking his star's leg. What? Do you need me to deal with your other leg too? <laughs> the school will call it self-defense anyway. Damn it. Am I gonna lose again? Not only can I not run anymore, the track team is gone too because of this asshole. So that's why. Once these two are dealt with, you're next. <laughs> Ryuji! You're right. Everything that was important to me was taken by him. I'll never get him back. Stay there and watch. Look on as these hopeless scum die for nothing because they sided with trash like you. No, that's what you are. All you think about is using people. You're the real scumbag, Kamoshida. What are you doing? Silence him! Stop looking down on me with that stupid smile on your face! You made me wait quite a while. You seek power, correct? Then let us form a pact. Since your name has been disgraced already, why not hoist the flag and wreak havoc? The other you who exists within desires it thus. I am thou, thou art I. There is no turning back. The skull of rebellion is your flag henceforth! What can you do? Cower in fear and watch! Persona? This effing rocks! Now that I got this power, it's time for payback! Yo, I'm ready! Bring it! Don't mock me, you brat! Blast him away, Captain Kid! Troublemakers that father keep Kamoshida's cognition ain't changing, right? Then I'll act like the troublemaker I am. Let's do this, Captain Kid! Kamoshida ain't anything special. How about that? Whoa. So Ryuji had the potential too. 
Even if you apologize now, I ain't forgiven you. I told you that this is my castle. It seems you still don't understand. What? Takamaki? Oh! What a meowless and beautiful girl! What's going on? You mention it, but why is she even here? Hey, let go of her, you perv! How many times must I tell you until you understand? This is my castle, a place in which I can do whatever I want. Everyone wishes to be loved by me. That is, everyone besides slow witted thieves like you. Takamaki! Say something! Calm down, Ryuji. It seems that girl isn't the real one. She's the same as those slaves. A being made from Kamashita's cognition of her. Are you jealous? Well, I'm not surprised. Women aren't drawn to problematic punks like you. <laughs> Damn it! Clean them up this instant! We're outnumbered. Let's scram before we get surrounded. We're not gonna do anything and just run? Thank God you've got a level head. <sighs> Fine. We'll expose what you really are no matter what. You better be ready for us. <laughs> I was beginning to get bored of torturing the ones here. Come at me whenever you want. If you don't care about your life. <laughs> Ignore him. Let's go! Anyways... I don't remember changing into this. Uh... Should I be happy about that? Then again... It ain't as bad as yours. Did you find them? Quiet! No, search that way. So what's going on? I'm completely... I told you before, when a Persona user opposes a palace's ruler and becomes a threat to them, this happens. It's to prevent you from being affected by distortions. Is this... a skull? Your appearance reflects your inner self. It's the rebel that slumbers within. Not that you'll get it. Nope. Then stop asking questions and accept what you see for what it is. Easy for you to say. Wait, we're in deep shit! I said to be quiet! We might have gotten away here, but we're still screwed with Kamoshida at the real school. That's quite sharp of you for being an idiot. Relax. The Kamashita in reality can't possibly know about what happens here. A shadow is the true self that is suppressed. A side of one's personality they don't want to see. So, we're okay? Did the Kamashita in reality remember about the execution? There you have it. All right. Now that we know that, all we gotta do is... Wait. I guided you as promised. It's your turn to cooperate with me. That's why I was super nice about teaching you idiots everything. Huh? Cooperate? Don't you remember? I originally came here for an investigation. I need to erase the distortion from my body and regain my real form. That's why we must delve deep into mementos and... Whoa, hold up. What are you going on and on about? We never said anything about helping you out. Huh? Don't tell me. Are you not going to repay the hospitality I showed you? Especially you! You're going to up and leave, even though you're already part of my master plan? Is it because I'm not human? Because I'm like a cat? Is that why you're making a fool of me? We're busy. Thanks for everything, cat. 
You've got guts being a cat and all. See you around. Hey! What the hell? Oh, seriously? Why are you wrapping this up like everything's all hunky-dory? Oh, hell no! Get back here! You have returned to the real world. Welcome back. <sighs> Thank God. We're back. Yeah, I dragged you around a lot, huh? Ugh, sorry, man. <sighs> I'm dead tired. How are you holding up? I guess you don't really show it, huh? But damn, if what we saw was for real, oh, this is gonna get good. I totally remember the faces of the guys Kamoshida was treating like slaves. Once we make him fess up to any physical abuse, Kamoshida will be done. So, wanna help me look for those guys or any witnesses? Now that's what I'm talking about! Hey, so... If you're thinking of laying low because you got a record, I don't think that'll help. Everyone already knows. They totally got you pegged as a criminal. Kamoshida opened his damn mouth. No one else besides a teacher could have leaked it that fast. It doesn't matter if it's a student or a club. That asshole just wrecks things he doesn't agree with. Just like he did with me. No one will take anything I say seriously. Still, those rumors about him getting physical might be real. And after seeing Kamoshida's distorted heart thing in person, there's no way I can just sit back. I'm counting on you. Don't worry, I'm hyped about this too. As a phantom thief would have been more efficient alone. You could have gone about it that way. However, you did not. There are merits to having associates. That's what you decided. Am I wrong? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new it shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the chariot persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. haven't eaten anything. It'd be weird splitting off now. So why don't we grab a bite somewhere? Just follow me. I mean, I totally got to hear about your past. What? The hell, man? How much shittier can that asshole get? Oh. My bad. So, you left your hometown, and you're living here now, huh? Huh, we might be more alike than I originally thought. You're the first guy that made me think that. I guess it's how we're treated like a pain in the ass by the people around us. Like we don't belong. I did something stupid at school before, too. The place you're living now is in Yongen, right? It's rush hour on the subways. I suggest you kill some time before heading home. What the hell, man? You barely touched your food. Just let me do it. I gotta thank you for helping me. 
Anyways, I got your back like you got mine from tomorrow on. As long as we do something about Kamoshida, I'm sure we'll both feel better about being at school. Oh yeah! Tell me your number. Oh, chat ID too. Just you wait, Kamoshida. We're gonna start right away tomorrow. First, let's hit up those guys that were kept as slaves. The volleyball rally's tomorrow, huh? <sighs> Shit's recommended by Kamoshida. Makes me want to gag. But thanks to that, we got no classes in the afternoon, and we can walk around unnoticed. Well, I guess we can work out the details tomorrow. Come on, you gotta eat more. There's tons of ginger here. So, about this plan to take down Kamoshida. Ah, right. been sleeping well lately. Whenever I close my eyes, I keep thinking about too many things. Shio. Nationals are coming up soon, so I keep thinking, should someone like me really be on the starting lineup? Don't worry. Just be confident in yourself. Your skills have been recognized. It's all because you work harder than anyone else. <laughs> yeah. Volleyball's all I have, after all. More importantly, was that injury okay? It looked really swollen. No, it's nothing. It's normal. Especially since the meet's coming up. <sighs> Sorry to interrupt, Suzui. Um, Mr. Kamashita told me to get you. Huh? What does he want? He didn't say. On, I... It'll be fine. I bet it's a meeting about the starting lineup or something. <laughs> yeah. Well, I better go. Yep. Good luck! Hang in there, Shiho. You're home. I take it you actually went to school today? I guess you learned your lesson after what happened yesterday. As long as you're not getting into trouble, it's fine by me. I don't know what you've been up to, but trust me, you'll be gone if you start causing problems. In case you forgot, your life is not a free one right now. Just stay away from bad influences, okay? Hey, I'm gonna head home for the night. I'll lock the store up. Don't go wandering out.
I should write something. Welcome to the Velvet Room. I thought about resuming our previous conversation tonight. That is why I have summoned you. What are your thoughts? Are you becoming accustomed to this place? What are your thoughts? Are you becoming accustomed? Ah, glad to hear it. It seems you have nerves of steel. The goal of your rehabilitation is to thwart the fated ruin. However, such a feat cannot be done by you alone. 
Today, you entered a partnership with someone who awoke to the same power, did you not? Involving yourself with others is an important foundation for your recovery. You've done well. That said, I am not advising the formation of superficial relationships. It must not be a frivolity, but a ring of those who would, by morals or faith, lend you their strength. In other words, they are bonds with those who have been robbed of their places to belong. The expansion of said ring will, in return, help you mature as well. Personas are the strength of heart. The stronger the bonds that surround you, the more power your personas will gain. There are countless people in the city who have talents that a weakling like you doesn't. You better rack that noggin of yours and get them on your side. We'll change that into power. Indeed, you should be prepared to use even myself, or your ambitions will not come to fruition. <laughs> we have a deal then. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Fool Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Well, you will understand it all in due time. Continue devoting yourself to your rehabilitation. Now this conversation's over. Get lost, inmate. How annoying. We've barely started high school and already they're making us play at a volleyball rally? And why are they pitting us against the teacher team? Kamoshida's gonna crush us. We get to see his technique live and in person, though. We should totally get spiked on. Yeah, okay. You're gonna get your face smashed in. Just look at how banged up the volleyball team is. What the hell goes on during their practices? Okay, quiet down. Coach? Thanks. Let's go for one more. Yeah. All right. Right? Sorry. Hey, 
Are you all right? Someone, take him to the nurse's office. You get that side. He'll pay soon enough. All right, let's resume the match. That asshole's acting like a king over here, too. Get to know each other better, my ass. It's just a one-man show for him to stroke his ego. Oh, oh, and how he acted like he was worried about Mishima. Oh, what an abusive D-bag. <sighs> well, anyways, now's our chance to go look for the guys we saw were slaves yesterday. Let's look for the faces we saw at the castle. All the members of the team should be here today. I'll be sure to find someone to spill about Kamoshida's physical abuse. Just you wait, asshole. The first one that popped out was a guy from Class D, so let's start from there. That's your class. Hopefully you can get him to talk without any issues. People have been avoiding me lately, so... Oh, but you're kind of in the same boat, huh? Skipping out on the volleyball rally? I guess I expect it from you, Transfer. Hey, that's the guy who was over at that castle. You too, Sakamoto? What do you guys want? What? W what, are you, what are you saying? No, of It's Kamoshida, ain't it? Look, I ain't gonna tell anyone you squealed. 
Just tell us about how Kamoshida's abusing you. I... I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not. You guys are talking complete nonsense. Don't try and hide it. We already know. You know? You have proof. Well, uh... This is ridiculous. Please, leave me alone. You really bother... <sighs> All right, that's enough. That injury ain't normal, and he still won't fess up. Crap. If we keep going at this pace, the ball game's gonna end. I guess that'd be fast. I'll check the practice building for people before clubs start. You handle the classroom building. There's a third year on the volleyball team that I remember. I think he's in... He's, he was getting beat pretty badly at the castle. He might have some injuries here. Anyways, I'll hit you up if I find any. Let's do it.
for a sec. It'll be quick. Anyway, what's with you? Like how you were late the other day was a lie and all? There's that weird rumor about you, too. What do you want with him? Right back at you. You're not even in our class. We just happen to get to know each other. What are you planning on doing to Mr. Kamoshida? Huh? I see. I get ya. You're all buddy-buddy with Kamoshida after all. This has nothing to do with you, Sakamoto. If you found out what he's been doing behind your back, you'd dump him right away. Behind my back? What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> you wouldn't get it. Anyway, people are already talking about you two. I don't know what you're trying to pull, but no one's gonna help you. I'm warning you, just in case. Why she gotta be so aggressive all the time? She's been like that since middle school. Anyways, that's not what we're here to talk about. I had no luck on my end. What if did anything like someone's name? Huh? Special coaching, huh? True. I always see the guy covered in bruises. Let's go talk to him before he leaves then. Hey, got a second? Sakamoto? And you, too. Come on, we just want to chat. Kamoshida's been coaching you, huh? You sure it's not just physical abuse? 
Certainly not. What are you talking all polite for? Anyways, we saw him spike you today, right in the face. That was just because I'm not good at the sport. Still, that doesn't explain all the other bruises you've got. They're from practice. Is he forcing you to keep quiet? That's... What's going on here? Mishima, isn't it time for practice? Uh, I'm not feeling well today. What? Maybe you're better off quitting then. You're never going to improve that crappy form unless you show up to practice. Didn't you hear? He ain't feeling well. Well, Mishima, are you coming to practice or not? I'll go. As for you, any more trouble and you'll be gone from the school for sure. Bastard. Same goes for you. Didn't the principal tell you to keep in line? Just don't get in the way of my practice. All these unsettling rumors are making the students anxious after all. That's your own goddamn fault. This won't get us anywhere. Let's go, Mishima. Shujin Academy is a place where those with aspirations come to learn. Unworthy students like yourselves don't have any right to be here. Get with the program. Yes, sir. He's gonna pay for this. There's no point. Huh? Proving that he's physically abusing us is meaningless. Everybody knows. The principal, our parents. They all know, and they all keep quiet about it. This has gotta be a joke. Don't be a pain. You don't understand what I'm going through. Shouldn't you, of all people, know that nothing's going to help? <sighs> Damn it. <sighs> I'll try one more time to persuade the other guys. That's all I can do. I should write something.
you be heading to volleyball? Uh huh. That bruise above your eye. Is that from practice too? Y yeah. Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? I'm okay. Volleyball's the only thing I can do right. Shouldn't you take that? It's probably just my part-time job, I think. I should get going. Shiho. Uh-huh. Yes. T today won't work. I'm... I'm sorry. Isn't that Takamaki? Rumor has it she's dating Kamoshida. Seriously? I heard people saw them in his car together. You know, she seems pretty easy, huh? You think I'd have a chance to? Come on, dude. You can't go after Kamoshida's bitch. <sighs> what? Uh, oh, I'm in the way, aren't I? It's totally my fault. I shouldn't have been spacing. Hmm. You don't look familiar. Could you be that transfer student from Class D? Um, this might not be any of my business, but don't let the rumors get to you, okay? I'm glad to hear that. My best friend is often misunderstood, too. All because of her looks. Uh, sorry. I didn't mean to drag on like that. Anyway, I have to go to practice. I'll see you around. Damn it! What the hell? like? All of them kept saying the same shit Mishima was talking about. Kamoshida had to have told him something. At this rate, looks like we'll have to go to him directly. I know. But seriously, isn't there something we can do? No way I'm gonna give in like this. Can you think of anything? be fine if we could do it without getting caught, but if we did, we'd be seriously done for. You got any other ideas? So you want to tell them about the castle? They'd never believe us. <sighs> Have any other ideas? What do we do? The king? You mean that other world's Kamoshida? I didn't think of that, but is there any meaning to... I finally found you! You say something. Don't think you can get away with not paying me back for helping you. That voice... Is that you, Morgana? How dare you up and leaving me the other day! The cat's talking? I am NOT a cat! This is just what happened when I came to this world. It was a lot of trouble finding you two. Wait, you came to our world? <gasps> Does that mean you've got a phone? You don't need one when you're at my level. I did get pretty lost making my escape, though. That aside, why can you talk? You're a cat! How should I know? You hearing this too? Joking around! You guys are having a rough time of this, hmm. I heard you mention something about witnesses. Oh, shut up! You know, I could tell you a thing or two about what to do about Kamashita. 
You were pretty close just a moment ago. God, that condescending attitude. This thing's gotta be Morgana. You were still doubting me? God, quiet! Uh, we really have to be looking for a cat in a busy time like this? I just heard a meow somewhere near here. Didn't you hear it? Uh, make sure you check every nook and cranny around. Meow? Does that mean only us two can understand what you're saying? Looks like it. What the hell's going on? Anyways, what you were talking about earlier, is it for real? You're quite the skeptic for being an idiot. Hey, tell us more. Then again, this probably ain't the best place. Here, stick it in your bag for now. It should be just small enough to fit. Hey, how dare you treat me like... Don't be so rough with me. Enough of that. You said you know how we can do something about Kamoshida, right? It has to do with what this guy was talking about earlier. You'll need to attack his castle. What do you mean? That castle is how Kamoshida views this school. He doesn't realize what happens in there, but it's deeply connected to the depths of his heart. Thus, if the castle disappears, it would naturally impact the real Kamoshida. What had happened? A palace is a manifestation of a person's distorted desires. So, if that castle were no more... Precisely. You sure pick up things fast. For real? He he's gonna turn good? But is that really getting back at him? Erasing a palace essentially means forcing the owner to have a change of heart. However, even though their warped wants disappear, the crimes they committed remain. Kamoshida will become unable to bear the weight of those crimes, and he'll confess them himself. You for real? That's possible? And since the palace will no longer exist, he'll forget what we did there as well. Not only will we be able to bring Kamoshida down, but there won't even be a trace of our involvement. That's amazing! True, except for the cat part. So, how do we get rid of the palace? By stealing the treasure held within. Stealing? I'll tell you more once you agree to go ahead with this. It's my most valuable secret plan, after all. If you want to help me out, I'll gladly teach you. Our luck's running dry looking for witnesses. Guess we have no choice but to go along. Good. Oh, right. There's one more thing I should tell you. If we erase a palace, there is no doubt that the person's distorted desires will be erased as well. But desires are what we all need in order to survive. The will to sleep, eat, fall in love. What are you getting at? If all of those yearnings were to vanish, they'd be no different than someone who is shut down entirely. They may even die if they're not given proper care. So... They might die! Will you listen to everything I have to say first? Would their death be our fault? Aren't you determined enough to face those kinds of risks? Hey, what do you think? For real? Sheesh. I come all this way and this is what I get. It's not like anyone will ever... That's not the point. If we just go around secretly doing whatever we want, we'd be no better than that effing Kamoshida. <sighs> Isn't this your only option? I'll come back later. Make sure you've made your decision by then. Man, we're getting all worked up for nothing. I'll try and see if I can figure out another way. Come on, let's get out of here.
please give it a rest? I told you, I'm not feeling up to it. Wait, what? That's not what you promised. And you call yourself a teacher? This has nothing to do with Shiho. Uh, Shiho's starting position. Wait, were you listening? Haven't you heard of privacy? Uh, no, I was out of line. So, how much did you hear? Nothing at all. Nothing. about me. <laughs> what the heck? I don't have anything to talk about with you. It was just an argument. You've heard the rumors, haven't you? About Mr. Kamoshida. Everyone says we're getting it on. But that's so not true. <clears throat> that was him on the other line. I avoided giving him my number for the longest time. He told me to go to his place after this. <sighs> you know what it means. I turn him down, he said he'd take my friend off as a regular on the team. I've been telling myself this is all for Shiho's sake. I can't take it anymore. Uh, uh. I've had enough of this. I hate him. But still, Shiho's my best friend. She's all I have left in that sorry excuse of a school. Tell me, what should I do? Sorry, I shouldn't have asked. It's not your problem. <laughs> what? What am I saying? I barely... So weird. Usually everyone just ignores me. Are you really a bad person? I've heard people talking about you, but I just don't see it. Uh, that you assaulted someone. That you almost killed them. I kinda had a feeling they were all just exaggerations. You seemed lonely. Almost like you didn't belong anywhere. You're the same in that regard. Maybe that's why it was so easy for me to talk to you. Is there really no way for me to help Shio? I wish 
she'd just change his mind. Like, forget about me and everything. As if something like that would ever happen. I wasn't asking for a serious response. But I do feel a bit better now. I'm gonna head home. Don't tell anyone what I told you, okay? I'll try and think of a way to persuade Kamoshida. Well, thanks. Suzui. Are you leaving? What is it? Mr. Kamashita's asking for you. He's in the PE faculty office. What did he say? I don't know. Well, I have to go. lies. By the way, you haven't been hanging around any bad influences, have you? I hope I don't have to. Listen, you need to be careful who you hang with. The only one you're gonna hurt is yourself. Ooh, look at the time. Seriously, think about how I feel having to stay up here waiting for you. I'm leaving. In the future, try not to come back so damn late. Understood? So I assume all of you know about the separation of powers. There are three branches in our government. The National Diet is legislative, the Cabinet is executive, and the Supreme Court is judiciary. This division of power provides checks and balances, which ensures no one branch becomes unstoppable. Have you made up your mind? No matter how much thinking you do, there's only one option. You'd be better off just listening to me. I just hear a cat just now? Mm, mm, meow! Hmm. Could that rumored cat be somewhere nearby? Settle down! We're in the middle of an important lecture.
If you only knew I'm reading this. T hey, what's that? Enough. This is a class. Wait, she's going to jump. Suzui? Shiho? For real? Come Who on, is it? Hey, stay in your seats. Do not step foot outside. No way. Huh? Is she going to commit suicide? It's Suzui. Shiho Suzui. Huh? What's going on? We should head to the court. Hey, I've got to get past here. Uh huh? Don't. Put Sorry, coming through. We need someone to go with her. Are there any teachers around? Uh, I'm not in charge of her class, though. Well, we should leave this to Principal Kobayakawa. I'll go! Please hurry! Shimak. We're gonna make him talk this time. Teachers, return to your classrooms for the time being. Please do not let any students go home yet. Why'd you run like that, huh? I didn't run. She jumped and tried to kill herself! Leave me alone. He's right. We ain't trying to get you busted. We won't say you talked either. Susui. She was called out by Mr. Kamashita. Wait, what? I was called by him a number of times too. To the teacher's room. It wasn't just me or Suzui either. He'd nominate someone when he was in a bad mood and hit them. So the physical punishment thing was for real. Yesterday, 
He called Suzui out of the blue. She didn't make any mistakes or anything. Mr. Kamashita seemed really irritated that day. So it must have been worse than usual. He didn't. That son of a bitch! Uh. I bet Sakamoto's going to find Mr. Kamashita. Mr. Kamashita's probably in the PE faculty office on the second floor. Went into the P faculty office. Let's hurry. Really? Huh? You bastard! The hell did you do to that girl? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb with me. That is enough. What you did was in coaching. What did you say? You... You ordered me to call Suzui here. I can only imagine what you did to her. You're going on and on about things you have no proof of. Basically, you're simply making these claims because you can't be a regular on the team, right? That's not what this is about! Even if it is exactly as you imagine it to be, hypothetically speaking, what can you do? We just received a call from the hospital. Suzui's in a coma, and her chances of recovery are slim. How would someone like that make a statement? There's no chance of her getting better, I hear. Oh, the poor girl. No. I can't be. God damn! This again? Does this mean we need to have yet another case of self-defense? You shut your mouth, you son of a bitch! Why are you stopping me? But still! Oh, you're stopping him? What a surprise. There's no need to hold back. Why not attack me? Oh, you can't. <laughs> but of course you can. Everyone present right now will be expelled. I'm reporting all of you at the next board meeting. What? You can't make a decision like that. Who would seriously consider what scum like you say? You threaten me too, Mishima. So you're just as responsible. Huh? To think you didn't know why I kept someone as talentless as you on the team. You act like you're a victim, but you leaked his criminal records, didn't you? It's all over the internet, correct? How terrible. Mishima? He told me to do it. I had no choice. <laughs> now, are we finished here? You're all expelled. You're done for. Your futures are mine to take. Now get out of my sight. I can't believe this asshole's getting away with this! Huh? Oh, right. We have that... Huh? Have you lost your minds? You worthless kids aren't making any sense. But sure, go ahead and after all, you'll have plenty of time to kill until expulsion. We can't waste any time. We gotta hurry up and go to that world and beat the shit out of that asshole. We're not beating him up. We're simply stealing his distorted desires. Can I assume that you've made up your minds about this? About how he might suffer a mental shutdown? I have. Someone almost died because of him. I don't give a rat's ass what happens to him anymore. And you? Then it's settled. By the way, is getting rid of a palace hard? You've tried it before, right? When did I ever say that? Huh? 
What? Were you just pretending to know? Is it true that you're getting expelled? Everyone's talking about it. That asshole's at it again. So you came all this way to tell us that? If you're going to deal with Kamoshida, let me in on it too. I can't just sit back and do nothing after what happened to Shiho. This has nothing to do with you. Don't butt your head into this. But it does! Shiho's my... I said don't get in our way! That was harsh. We can't take her somewhere like that. I hope she doesn't do anything too crazy. Women can be much bolder than men at times. We just gotta hurry up and deal with Kamoshida. Let's go already. The moment we cross over, we'll treat each other like phantom thieves. So I hope you're ready. Uh huh? Phantom thieves? Those who covertly sneak in and stylishly steal treasure. That is what we become. <laughs> that sounds kind of cool. So we just gotta say the school, Kamoshida's name, and castle. And then we end up in Bizarro World. How the hell's all this work? Someone make it? <laughs> That's kind of creepy, but uh, we'll show that effing Kamoshida. Let's go. They really are going to do something. They're doing something on their phone. through what is this to Sukamaki <gasps> that voice Sukamoto and are you Wh why are you here how should I know what's going on hey where are we isn't this the school I see. Perhaps she was dragged in because of that app thing. If multiple people can enter with the person who uses it, it stands to reason it'll pull anyone nearby. For real? Wait, so this is related to Kamoshida? Anyways, you gotta leave! No! The shadows are going to find us if you make a scene. No way! It's hot! Oh my god! It's a mo monster! You better explain what's going on! I won't leave until you do! <sighs> Looks like we gotta force her. But how are we supposed to do that? Just take her back to where we came in. That's how it worked last time, right? Uh oh yeah! Can you lend me a hand? What are you? We'll explain after everything's over. Hey! And just... Whoa, sorry, I didn't mean... That's not important. You guys, seriously? Ah! <sighs> we better be careful from now on when we use that app. You should have checked the tools you use. Why do I, the one who was just watching, know more about it than you two? Up. Ah, jeez. Takamaki found out right when we were starting off. We gotta deal with this fast. That girl's name is An Takamaki, right? Lady An. The shadows have noticed us. You better brace yourselves, got it? We're counting on you, Joker. Joker? Not a nickname? 
Don't refer to it in such a lame way. It's a code name. What kind of stupid phantom thief would use their real name? I'm not down for that. And there's no telling what kind of effect yelling our real names will have on the palace. It's just a precaution. So, uh, why is he Joker? Because he's our trump card when it comes to fighting strength. It's settled then. Next up is you, Ryuji. You'll be... thug. Are you picking a fight with me? Yeah, I'll choose it myself! <laughs> when it comes to me, it's gotta be this mask. Honestly, I actually kinda like it. What if we named me after this? Fine. Why not Skull, then? Oh, that sounds awesome! <laughs> I'm Skull! What do we do about this one's code name? How about Mona? Well, if Joker thinks it's easier to call me that, then I'll go with it. All right, from here on out, we are Joker, Skull, and Mona. We need to be absolutely thorough about using those code names from now on. All right, time to go steal this treasure thing. Let's make a dash for it. Intruders the other day were quite entertaining. However, I can't allow that trash to ransack my castle. Strike to the security, kill them on sight. I'll reward whoever brings me their heads. Praise be to King Kamashita! Death to the intruders! Hey Mona, can't we just beat the crap out of him and call it a day? Look at all those soldiers, idiot! It'd be suicide! And I'm sure you don't want a repeat of last time. Besides, don't you want him to confess his sins? There's no point beating him up. We need to steal his materialized desires. The treasure. Fine. Uh, so where is it? It has to be somewhere in the depths of this castle. Let's infiltrate further in while he's out here. Death to the intruders! I think it's impossible. and all-out attacks? I'll teach you their practical use. There's another use for hold-ups, besides simply defeating enemies. Shadows are beings born from people's hearts, so naturally they can talk, too. In other words, you can communicate with them. If you talk to them when they're cornered, they might offer money or items since they don't want to die. In fact, talking has a better chance of scoring something great, as opposed to just offing them. Well then, let's do the first step. Knock all the enemies down and do a hold-up. Something along those lines. Now let it be money or items. Just call. Sorry. Oh, wait, 
What? Hmm. This isn't... Uh, if that's the case... I guess... <gasps> Sorry, but we're in a hurry. Taken the shadow's appearance and power. Next up. Sealed the enemy's appearance and powers into his mask, and made it as is such a feat even possible? Even I've never seen anyone pull that off. Of course it is! Only one heart exists per person, so normally a person can only have one persona. Incredible! That ability will give us a huge advantage in battle. Alright, try to do that even more if the opportunity arises. You better help out too, Skull. Yeah, we'll hold every last one. <laughs> I like you even more now. I really do have something special after all. chest. I'll reveal your Who true you? form.
Your power's incredible, Joker! It's a step forward. Alright. I'll reveal your true you? form. your true form.
look. This is that place from earlier. What's up with this app? Just said the word Sakamoto said and I ended up... Princess? Huh? Princess! there even more shadows here than before? Just getting this far has been a real pain in my ass. It's all because you guys provoked Kamoshida, you know. Still, he seems to be awfully on guard. Anyways, how are we supposed to steal that treasure thing? Don't be so hasty. First, we'll need to secure an infiltration route. A uh, what? A path to the treasure's location. But honestly... I think we'll need a little more manpower in order to accomplish At the very least, one more person would be nice. Hey, you say you don't have your memories and all, but somehow you still know about that kind of... Do you think this thing's really got amnesia? At least you're a step above that moron. Don't call me a moron. You sure talk big, but what if it turns out you're just some stray cat in the end? That can't be. Still, why was a princess in such an odd place? Princess? I could have sworn we were pursuing the readings of an intruder. It doesn't matter now. We must take her back to King Kamashita. Who's this princess they're talking about? I should probably look into this. And yet another question goes on in. Stuff like the castle and that navigation app are mysterious, <laughs> but Morgana's got them both beat. What was I again? Oh, yeah, a uh, skull. This is bad. That was fast. Your friend, Lady On. She's been taken by shadows. Wait, what? We sent her home earlier. If Lady On does indeed have the app, it could be possible. Oh, no. Don't tell me it got put on hers just like mine. Damn it. We let her out for her own safety, and she just came back in by herself. Damn it. Let's do it. is the intruder. Hamoshida? Who's that? More importantly, what is this place? Why is the school turned into something like this? I can't believe you mistook my aunt for someone like her. <laughs> Are you afraid? Please here. After all, this is my castle. The world of my desires. What the? Wait. Is this some red light district? What a lively slave. This isn't funny! Enough of the bullshit! 
shit, Kamoshida! Shit. <laughs> the girls decided to tell me off. What do you think of that? Talking back is like totally unforgivable. In that case, she should be executed. <laughs> now then, how should I play with you? Shall I tear you into little pieces? Are you kidding me? This is effed up. Is that what he thinks of the girls on the volleyball team? Hey, that's... Takamaki! <sighs> Just when I was about to start enjoying myself. What's the deal with this guy? You little... How many times are you gonna come back? I bet you just like those thieves. You came because you're pissed at me, huh? But, uh... Ah, I forget that chick's name. But it's your fault she jumped, you know. Huh? You were so reluctant to throw yourself onto me that I had her take your place. You bastard! <laughs> no! Take one more step and I'll kill her on the spot. Just sit back and enjoy the dismantlement show. No, don't! Maybe I'll start with the clothes. <laughs> You're such a perv! Hey, what are we gonna do? Takamaki! Is this... That's more like it. You should have looked like this from the start. Shio... I'm so sorry. Huh? You're right. Letting this piece of shit toy with me. <laughs> what was I thinking? It's like I always say. Slaves should just behave and... Shut up! I've had enough of this. You pissed me off, you son of a bitch! My, it's taken far too long. Uh, uh, Tell me, who is going to avenge her if you don't? Forgiving him was never the option. Such is the scream of the other you that dwells with him. I am thou, thou art I. We can finally forge a contract. I hear you, Carmen. You're right. No more holding back. <laughs> there you go. Nothing can be solved by restraining yourself. Understand? Then I'll gladly lend you my strength. <laughs> You know what? I'm not some cheap girl you can toy with, you scumbag. Bitch! You stole everything from Shiko. You destroyed her. Now it's your turn! I will rob you of everything! How dare you! Enough of your insolence! No, I've had enough of you! No one's gonna stop me now! Let's go, Carmen! How dare you deny King Kamoshida's love, you selfish lass! Pay for this insolence with your life! That dirtbag just sees women as sexual outlets! Don't make me laugh with that love bullshit! Come on, Carmen! Let's give him hell! Persona! Damn, Carmen! You did it! They've fallen flat!
Here, man, and more importantly, how? Hey, is that how you speak to a woman? Are you all right, Lady On? Lady On? Wait, what is this thing? Is it alive? How can it talk? And where in the world are we? J just calm down. Everything's going to be okay. Don't worry. How am I supposed to calm down? Huh? Why am I dressed like this? When did I... <sighs> What's with this? Huh? What are you talking about? Well, I'm stumped. A search party will be coming for us soon. There's no time to explain. We don't have a choice. Let's retreat for now. We were just getting fired up and you had to go and get in the way. Here, give me your arm. You take the other side. Mm, thanks. Looks like we made it back. Hey, are you okay? Well, pretty much. Wait, I lied. I'm still confused about all of this. You may be safe now, but a lot sure did happen back there. At any rate, we stand out too much here. Let's relocate to a safer spot. Which one you want? Whichever's not carbonated. Uh, they're both actually. Then... Here you go. What about me? Huh? But uh, you're a cat. <laughs> Have you calmed down, Lady On? Um, Morgana, right? I really am talking to a cat. This feels so strange. Oh, sorry. You're not a cat, right? It's only natural that you're confused. Demanding that you understand all of this right after what you went through is asking too much. Honestly, I still can't believe what happened. And that power. It's the will of your rebellion, Lady On. With it, you'll be... So if what you told me is true, we can make Kamoshida have a change of heart. Is it really possible? Can we actually force him to confess his crimes? The volleyball team's keeping quiet about this while teachers and parents turn a blind eye. If guys like us try and complain, they're just gonna shoot us down. Going all in on this plan is the only choice we got. Then let me help too. I want to make him pay for what happened to Shiho. He just keeps going like nothing happened, even after what he did to her. I'll never forgive him. Wait, did you just say, let me help? You mean you want us to take you along? Don't act like I'm going to drag you down. Aren't you watching? I can fight too. Hey, what should we do? I agree as well. We are lacking in manpower after all. 
don't worry. I'll protect her. Even if you said no, I'd just go in alone. Ah, right, she can go by herself. I guess it'd be more dangerous turning her down. Ah, fine. Then it's decided. Well, <laughs> I hope we get along. I'm going to make Kamoshida atone for what he did. Not just for Shiho's sake, but for everything he's done. I won't let any more people suffer because of him. I'll do whatever it takes. A group like yours must have relied on subtlety and misdirection. Otherwise, you'd never survive. Some of you might even have been hiding behind a public face their entire lives. If you're listening, then answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the lover's persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Just let me know when you're heading back in. Oh, wait. Hey, give me your number and chat ID. I'll be counting on you then. Same goes for you, Morgana. The pleasure is all mine, Lady On. What a kind girl. Such admirable consideration for others and the innocence to cast herself into the jaws of death to achieve her goal. She cares about her friends, and she's beautiful to boot. What a girl. She's captured my heart. Dude. You know, it'd be better if this group could get together quick from now on. True. Our best option would be to make a secret hideout where we could discuss these things. A hideout, huh? I like the sound of that. The school rooftop would work. It seems like nobody goes up there. For the time being, that will make the perfect hideout. I can't contact you from inside a palace, so I'll stay in this world. That being said, I'll need someone to take care of me. I'm personally nominating you. You should feel honored. This is all you. There's no way I can at my place. The train well, we now have our hideout, so let's meet there tomorrow. Okay, let's go look at my new residence for this world. Stay upstairs while we're open for business. Yes? Hey, lay off the customers. Sorry if he was rude, Doctor. I don't mind. Come on, you're getting in the way. Go on upstairs. <laughs> Thanks. I'll see you later. Come back again. That's it for today. Oh, that customer just now? She's the head doctor over at that clinic down the street. Rumor has it she gives pretty crappy examinations and sells some weird homemade medicines on top of that. At least, that's what I've heard. I haven't been there myself. They should really just leave her alone. It's not like she's getting in the way of their lives. Hey, are we there yet? <sighs> well, I gotta get home and start making dinner. What the? What is 
this place? Is this some kind of abandoned house? Hey, are you... I was wondering why I heard meowing. What did you bring it here for? That's... It's a shame. Look, this place is a restaurant. Animals are a no-go. Though, I guess you might stay on good behavior if you've got a pet to take care of. Fine. But keep it quiet when we're open for business. And don't let it roam downstairs, or I'll toss it out. Oh, and I'm not going to take care of it. That's all on you. Was that the ruler of this place? He seemed pretty understanding for someone who keeps you cramped up in this dump. Then again, I suppose to normal people I just sound like a meowing cat. Seriously, I had to keep calling out in that cute little voice. Make sure you wash that dish. By the way, uh, have you decided on a... Morgana? Huh, I was hoping I'd get to name it. Looks like the Chief likes me better than you. And to be honest, this place is heaven compared to Kamoshida's cells. Remember how you guys asked me before about what I am? To be honest, I don't remember anything about my birth. I think the Metaverse's distortions made me lose both my memories and my true form. I already told you, I'm an honest-to-God human. If I were originally just a cat, how could I talk? It doesn't make any sense. There's no doubt that the distortions were what caused me to lose my real self. I'm sure that once they're purged, I'll finally be able to get that self back. And I have a pretty good idea on how to do it, too. That's why I was in the castle in the first place. Come to think of it, I didn't get hungry over in that world. Let me make myself clear. Your taking care of me won't be for nothing. It'll be give and take. Due to my knowledgeable and dexterous nature, I have a lot of intel on infiltration tools. Whoa. I can't tell you more unless we settle on a deal. In exchange for you keeping me here, I'll teach you about these tools. How does that sound? I like that answer. <laughs> then it's a deal. Skillful infiltrations and escapes to all manner of places. There's even the possibility that you use special tools and had someone who manufactured them. Answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the magician persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. you about the infiltration tools over time. By the way, the power you used in the palace was seriously amazing. The stronger that power gets, 
the more reliable it'll be as a trump card. All right, I'm gonna stick with you wherever you go from today on. Personas are the strengths born from one's heart. Depending on what kind of life experience you gain, I bet it'll affect that power as well. And if you become acquainted with capable people, you might learn various useful skills too. This is all part of our deal. Got it? I expect great things from you. Don't let me down, okay? messages to each other with that thing, right? I wanted to, so I'm gonna have to ask you to type for me. Looks like we're all here. Okay, let's get going. Hold on, it's still too early for us to head to the palace. But why? Don't we just gotta steal that treasure thing? Don't underestimate the dangers of that place. We need to prepare. Ain't that persona shit we got enough to deal with it? That's exactly what I mean when I say don't underestimate it. 
You'll die if you mess up in there. So again, we need to prepare before we head in. But how exactly are we supposed to do that? I'm glad you asked, Lady On. First, we'll need to find better equipment for all of you. You talking about weapons? Oh, I know a kick-ass place. In that case, you can handle that side of things. The only other thing would be stocking up on medicine. Fatigue is unavoidable in a palace. And where can we get medicine? Don't worry, I know just the place. I hope you look forward to it, Lady On. Now then, he and I have some business in Yongen, so let's head off for today. Just come with me. I won't be able to get close enough by myself. Can I talk? Actually... Hey! I'll just add this. 